Hey guys, day 25 around the world for free. I am in Guyana and I just switched continents. I'm in South America in the back of a car. I got picked up at the airport and I'm heading into Georgetown. Last time I checked in with you guys, I was pounding the pavement at the yacht club, trying so hard to get on a yacht or a boat. I don't think you'll find too many boats going this weekend. I don't think you'll find any boats going. You don't know one single person. So at the end of the day, I was hanging out at the boat club, basically waiting for them to kick me out, when this guy John comes up and starts talking to me. And he said he has an apartment here right across the street. Yes, sure. I do. I have really no option. So you're pretty much rescuing me right yeah, now. Yeah, okay, right on. I'm happy to do that. No <laughs> we hit it off, and then he offers me a place to stay. I'm getting a full-on rescue from this, this man. Hey guys. He lived right across the street. Oh my gosh, I love this place. That's great. It's awesome. Yeah. It was a nice open space, a beach loft, kind of like a bachelor pad. I love it, it's my favorite. This is a man's fridge. That's what a man's fridge looks like. Salud. Salud. My room, which is not made, a typical guy, I don't even know you're filming, I don't care. <laughs> um, I like typical guys. You're gonna have a lot of fun tonight, don't worry. Now, we'll call you, we'll all hook up and we'll, you know, this is how it works. I don't know what I'm doing. Right. Nobody knows what anyone, you know, anyone's doing. Sounds like my life. It just kind of comes together and, yeah. Dinner time, baby. I took a shower in warm water. I feel like a whole new woman. You smell like a whole new woman. Thank you. Good, so while all this madness is going on, this lady, Sarah, who'd been tweeting with me. I'm Sarah. Nice to meet you. Really working hard to try to get me some kind of travel out of the country. I actually bumped into her when I was hanging out with Patricia. And one of the things she did was connect me with her friend Robbie, who works at Red Jet. And he was telling me that Red Jet also flies to Guyana. So you're gonna work, you're gonna do the flight attendant, and, and in return, we're gonna bring you down to Guyana? Yeah, it's a great place, but you're gonna be in for a ride. Really? <laughs> Anacondas, Jaguars. Oh my gosh, that's uh, gonna, exactly yeah. what I want. That's beautiful I want country. That. As you guys can see, I didn't get a free ride this time. I had to work for my flight. <laughs> Back here. I will take that for you. Oh, good picture. Let me tag this baby. For your safety, you should always keep your seatbelt fastened at all times while seated. Do you guys want anything to drink or eat? Do you give him the whole bottle? The sandwich? The ham sandwich? And when we're a flight like this, we have to rush back and forth as fast as we can to get everyone served before we land. Thanks for showing me Thanks for all your help today. You were really good. Nice. You helped out a lot. Yeah. <laughs> good. I'm glad. Hi. I'm here to call you guys. Oh, great. Awesome. So I wrapped up my flight attendant duties. I got hustled through customs, got picked up at the airport. I'm heading to Georgetown. I have no idea who I'm gonna meet, but I'm very excited to be here in South America. It's completely different from the islands, from anywhere we've been so far. So send me your messages at cbs.com world. Let me know what you guys would like me to do, and I will check in with you as soon as I can.